How to customise your Die i4 or i5 mask. First you want to strip the mask down so that it's ready to be painted. Before painting, always put about one to two coats of primer on. Next use masking tape to mask up your paint or mask. This is to protect the mask from any overspray. Spray your choice of paint colour on the mask. Leave it to dry for one hour between coats and you're going to want around two to three coats on each side. Finally, you want to leave it 24 hours to fully dry. After it's dried, take the masking tape off and tape up the other side. Spray the other side with your choice of colour, again leaving it one hour in between coats. Now that both sides have dried for 24 hours, I can remove the masking tape. For the blood splatter look, I'm flicking paint off of the brush onto the mask. The last step is to protect your paint with lacquer, spray four to five coats on with four hours in between. Now watch carefully because I'm about to tell you